Okay, today we're with the guys at uh, Romeo Technologies and they're building these bonders. And what we have to do today is we've got to dial these bonders in to make sure that all these parts fit correctly and that they close correctly. But the first thing we want to do here is we want to put this thing into a level plane with the world. So I've got the tracker live today and we've got Polyworks up. So what we're going to do is we're going to set an orient to gravity first and then we're going to start to do some measurements here. But I want to show you guys how we're going to do this gravity plane for starters, okay? So come into Polyworks with me and we'll take a look at it. So we have got a, a empty workspace right now. It's not titled, you can see my model tree is all bare naked. But since I want to establish my gravity plane as a starter, that's a perfect primary foundation to this measurement session. The way we're going to do that is we're going to come down here to this icon right here. And I'm already talking to the tracker. So what I do is I hit that little down arrow there and I go create level plane. Now when I do that, notice what's happening with the tracker. The tracker is going through some movements. It's going to take it a couple minutes and it's going to establish that gravity plane. So I'm going to speed up the, uh, the footage here so you can see how fast that thing goes and gets a level plane for me and then we'll come back to Polyworks. Okay, so there you have it. I've got a plane that Polyworks calls my level plane from the first position of the arm. So if I rotate that around, you can see I've got a 3D planar feature out there in Polyworks. So right now what I'm going to do is I'm going to do an alignment on this machine using a couple other features, and then I'll start to level this out to the gravity. So, but I just wanted to show you guys how we can take that tracker and easily talk to it and make it give us a level plane to gravity, which is this icon here and this option here.